Hi, hello, welcome to Harsha Thal Star Cafe. That's going to keep you fast, fun and happy. Today, we are going to learn about the main features of the French party system. There are five main features. The first one is multiplicity of parties. The first and the most important feature of French party system is its multiplicity character. This was so under the Third Republic and the same was in the case under the Fourth Republic and it is so even under the Fifth Republic. It was being continued from the Third, then it was passed down to the Fourth and now it is also continuing in the Fifth, that is the current Republic. Many causes are said to be responsible for the growth of multiple parties in France. Firstly, the French temperament is one of the reasons. As compared with Englishmen and Americans, the French are theoretical and not pragmatic in politics. They are also very individualistic and prefer to follow their own bent of mind than to follow others. Secondly, the many political upheavals through which France has passed have also added to the growth of multiple party system. Thirdly, the diversity of the French people in race, temperament, attitudes and wealth has divided them into many groups. Evidently, on account of this diversity of temperament, character and bent of mind, France provides a lot of field for the growth of political groups. Leaving one group and joining the other is an ordinary matter for an average Frenchman. Lastly, according to Salton, multiplicity of parties is in fact inevitable in any country where the fundamentals are themselves matters of dispute, where social and economic conditions have bought political power within the reach of all social classes and where highly developed and widely diffused education coupled with a strong spirit of individualism creates keenness of political thought and numerous political and social theories. This individualism of opinion renders impossible any measures of agreement on a large number of subjects and thus destroys the discipline which is the foundation of any party organization. The second point, diversity in organization and policies. The second main feature of French party system is the great diversity in both their organization and their policies. If on the one hand there are anti-parliamentary and even fascist groups, on the other there are groups professing faith in socialism and parliamentarianism. Some attach great importance to political principles and doctrines while others appear to have no general principles or coherent policy. Third point is fluidity. Another characteristic of the French party system is the fluidity of parties. Parties come and go in bewildering numbers, sometimes within a very short time. After the World War II, a number of parties were born while some disappeared. Some of the groups which take birth at the time of elections disappear after one or two assembly sessions. Many of these groups do not have any existence outside the assembly while there have been some groups which were formed in the country but were never represented in the parliament. The fourth point, constitutional recognition of the parties. The French constitution acknowledges the role of parties and political groups in Article 4 which reads, Parties and political groups play a part in the exercise of the right to vote. The right to form parties and their freedom of action are unrestricted. They must respect the principles of national sovereignty and of democracy. Adherence to personality cult Another unique feature of the French party system is in the fact that in France the parties revolve around charmistic personalities of their respective leaders. For winning the hearts of the teeming millions, the party depends upon the dynamism of their leaders. The leader is the focal point for fostering the party unity. The members are united because they owe allegiance to a particular leader.